I come home and there's just this slime covered <laughs> black blob on the fence line. It was just the biggest surprise. We had had no experience with baby alpacas before. Hey, Cashew. Good morning, babies. We were contacted by another rescue, Silver Swine Farm, about alpacas who they had rescued from a hoarding case. Cashew was the mom and she had two babies. She's actually the most docile of the three alpacas. Bedtime, Cashew. Cashew's always been fairly calm and fairly easy to handle, so I don't think she gave us any signs that she was pregnant. But something just felt in my gut like she was pregnant. Our vet did an ultrasound and didn't see anything. So we're like, oh, okay, that's weird. I guess she's just not pregnant. And then all of a sudden, Wally came out. <laughs> we're like, oh my God, you look like a Tim Burton character. He was this magical little weird alien <laughs> creature that we couldn't stop staring at. And we just kept being yeah. like, Mama, you made this. She was best mom. Mm -hmm. We had to watch him really closely for a few days, but pretty quickly he started getting the zoomies. He would just <laughs> race around their enclosure and their paddock. That was when we were like, okay, we think he's healthy. <laughs> He just seemed silly and playful immediately. He'll go at full speed and just slam into his mom or his sister <laughs> and kind of bounce off of them. They were just so tolerant of Wally and all of the energy he has. They're such a tight-knit family. They're always together. They're often snuggling. It's so unusual for animal families to stay together in animal agriculture, so it's really, really special when a sanctuary can take an entire family. In the summer, we had to evacuate because we were surrounded by wildfires. Thankfully, our property was safe, but with the worsening wildfire situation happening on the West Coast, we made a very hard decision to relocate all of our animals all the way to upstate New York. He did a great job traveling across the country with his mom, Wally. <laughs> the very well-traveled alpaca. Yeah. <laughs> Wally just seemed over the moon when he figured out that this was his home. Wally. Wally's the happiest animal I've ever met. Yeah. He really has never had a bad day. Wally will never know anything but like happy friends and joy. I just want him to spread his joy to everyone because he has so much of it. Ha <laughs> ha